MCV reporting. New construction options. Building. Construction complete. Building. New construction options. Construction complete. Building. New construction options. New rally point established. Construction complete. Building. New construction Relocating operations. Building Soviet economy. Looks like good place to mine. So on top, you're a little bit disadvantaged because you got to travel a little bit further for the gems. But always go for the gems first. Construction complete. Building. New construction options. The other huge thing to remember on Little Big Lake, and I'm pretty sure I don't do it this round. I, I really don't care because you know it's not a big deal. But um, you really want to scout their end of the water to see if they're going to go naval, especially if you don't plan on it. Because if they go naval, that means that they should be behind uh, the tank build. So if they click on naval, you got to immediately go for them. Otherwise, they can get out a dreadnought or a aircraft carrier and mess your day up. So I don't do a very good job of that here, but on Little Big Lake, it's, that's really important that you at least scout to the water. So that way, as soon as you see the naval, you go. Yeah, I don't do a good job. Don't be like me. I typically would go naval in like a, a real game, like if I was really trying to win. But I don't fucking care. Construction complete. Cannot deploy here. Building. Waiting order. Training. Location confirmed. So I'm stretching my base to get to this ore right here, and then once I get there, I'll defend it. But since he's being aggressive, I'm gonna, you know, say screw the radar. Go for another war factory, stretch that out, and then place an ore refinery. Building. Typically, if you're gonna build naval, though, you're not gonna be super aggressive just because you're supposed to be behind. So he should be turtling if I was thinking he was gonna go for naval, which he's obviously not doing. So this is a situation where he's really only got one spot to get to my base through. That's why I placed that sentry gun even though the desolator wasn't quite there yet. Um, now he can go all the way around uh, and try and get to my base through that way, but unless he does a split, as soon as I see him going that way I can just bum rush his base. So really the only place he can go is right here. So I'm gonna keep it pretty well defended. And the same thing with him, he, that's why he built that sentry gun right there. He knows that I've gotta kinda do the same thing. So I tried to get a little bit of damage out on it. Just to harass him. Moving. Location confirmed. Moving. Building. Unit ready. Da. Construction complete. Da. Unit lost. Moving out. Training. Unit ready. New Waiting rally order. point established. Moving. Waiting order. Location Waiting confirmed. order. 
Unit ready. This is really risky by me, because we're about even on tanks, so me coming in for that miner was pretty risky, but he kind of bum rushed right in, so I got another sentry gun out, and it made it pretty easy to soak up the damage. So I can play pretty conservatively now, which is what I choose to do. I think I took out two or three of his miners, and that one's just sitting there, which means he's broke. There's no way he has any money. Which is why I'm not sure he why he built that third war factory. Doesn't really help. Waiting order. Location confirmed. New construction Vehicle options. Reporting. Unit ready. Repairing. Ready, comrade. So I, I use the Vehicle repair reporting. facility as almost kind of a Unit bait. Because he knows that he's got to act ready. before I get any stronger. Unit lost. Building. Or miner under attack. Construction complete. Unit Vehicle ready. Reporting. But luckily he didn't go for naval. So we play again, and uh, I think we both go allied. Construction complete. Building. New yeah, construction yeah, we're both options. allied this match. Unit ready. Training. New rally point established. Unit ready. Ready. So I use the GIs so I can block off that section so no dogs will get even close and that way I can use my dogs to actually scout because I know he's not going to be able to scout me from that way. Construction complete. New construction options. Building. Unit lost. So I'd say he can see my ore refinery, but he can't see what's coming out of my war factory or my barracks, I don't think. So that's good for me. Unit ready. And there you see two dogs just get completely ready, annihilated. Ah, Construction complete. Cannot deploy here. Unit ready. Construction complete. New construction options. Unit ready. Training. New rally point established. Unit ready. I can go anywhere. Up Unit and ready. Over. New rally so you see that I'm putting him in a spot where I know he ready. can't see it. And that way I can surprise him with the Rocketeers. Unit ready. See you ready. Unit lost. Unit ready. Destination commander? Yes, sir. Unit ready. Hands up! On my way! Yes, sir. On our way, sir. Bound forward. Good to go. Ready to reporting. Push Unit away. ready. Up and over. Ready to soar. I can see you. Destination you. Command. commander? Bound forward. Unit reporting. Bound forward. Weapon ready. Unit ready. Vehicle ready. Destination Unit on our lost. Way, sir. So I figure here, even if he gets all my base, he's not going to get my MCV, 
And meanwhile, I can just take out everything with my Rocketeers. And he pretty much took out damn near everything, though, so... But I was pretty confident I could end the game without focusing on getting back in time to take that out. Construction complete. Four miner under attack. New construction options. Rockets in the sky. Unit lost. I'll take the high road. Construction complete. Got a steady flow. Unit ready. Riding high. Four miner under attack. Yes, sir. New construction options. On our way, sir. Building. Unit ready. Rockets in the sky. He's got no place to hide. He's hiding. <laughs> So then I just troll him for a little bit. I got one Rocketeer on each structure. I'm waiting for him to run on money. But he was fun to play against. Not too bad at all. I actually ended up playing against uh, a couple more fans lately. It was fun, uh, and I was surprised at how good they were too. And I finally played our other YouTube friend. So, be on the lookout for those videos. Thanks for watching. Peace.